Welcome, in this video I'll show you how to fix Steam low disk usage, alright? If you find this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more such tutorials. Now first up, you ought to open up the Steam app, and once done, click on Steam right here at the top left. Click on it, and once done, go ahead and click on Settings, alright? Once this one pops up, go ahead over to this tab, alright? Now go ahead and find Downloads. Click on it and once done, make sure that the download region is the one that is closest to you. Okay, as you can see here, I lived in the Philippines. When I go ahead and click on this drop down, as you can see, we have a ton of options for Philippines. But in my case, I am near Davao. So I'm going to go ahead and select Davao right here and just click on restart now. Wait for it. Now go ahead and log in with one of your Steam accounts. Once it's opened, go ahead and go back to the same set of pages, Steam right here, Settings, now Downloads, now scroll down and find a Clear Download Cache. Just click on it, hit on Confirm, it will shut down Steam again, just wait for the process to finish. And once done, log in and check if it helps. If that still will work, don't worry, we still have an option. Alright, just close the Steam app, like so. Go to the bottom right, right click on Steam app, hit on exit. Once done, go to your search bar and type down indexing options. All right, right here, just click on it. Now, this page will pop up. Now go ahead and click on modify. And here, make sure that your drive C or where your Steam app is installed is selected in here. Okay, as you can see here, mine is already selected. So just basically click on OK. Now, once that's done, click on Drive C, Advanced, Rebuild. All right. Now, since you're rebuilding the index, it might take a long time to complete. So just basically click on OK, wait for the process to finish. All right. As you can see here, indexing in progress, just basically wait for it. And once it says complete right here, you can now go ahead and close this pop up. And then once done, restart computer. Launch Steam again and everything should work perfectly fine now. And that is it. Well, I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.